guys, welcome to the review of the Nissan Terra. So today we're going to review the Nissan Terra VE. So the Nissan Terra is a SUV. It's an SUV from Nissan, set to compete with the Mitsubishi Montero Sport, Toyota Fortuner, and the likes. So this Nissan Terra mid-model, uh, the VE1, features the same engine across the lineup, which is a 2.5 liter turbo diesel engine with a variable geometry turbocharger uh, having an output of 190 PS and 450 Nm of torque so let's talk about the ride of the Nissan Terra first so I've brought this SUV uh, in the twisties of Marilake uh, in the highways of the North Luzon Expressway so I can safely say that it, it really has the power to get you there 190 horsepower is more than enough and sur surprisingly delivers good consumption during my highway stint I averaged around 13 kilometers per liter even in the twisties of Marilake comfort wise the five link suspension helps a lot in giving out the best comfort for the passengers. So even for a mid model, the Nissan Terra VE has a lot of features that you will really like. For example, it has a Bluetooth connection, auxiliary ports, it has a Android Auto, Apple CarPlay for its entertainment system. It also has a rear backup sensor that really helps a lot since this vehicle is kinda big for its uh, category so there expect that there's a lot of blind spot which is very normal in this category so there are small features in this Nissan Terra that is available across the lineup that you will really like for example in its interior you can see the 12 volt socket across the dashboard and there's also a, a 12 volt socket under the controls of the climate control so this model is equipped with a 7 speed automatic transmission which is very responsive in the highway when you need the power most it really kicks down a gear or two immediately so some amenities that you will also really like in this vehicle, uh, it has st steering mounted audio controls, uh, a trip meter, a fuel consumption meter, it has a sun sunshade compartment, also it has a headlight leveling system, so speaking of the headlight, this model is already equipped with an LED system and daytime running lights so now we're going to talk about uh, its safety features so the Nissan Terra for me is a very safe vehicle for a mid-model uh, variant 
it already has an anti-lock braking system, electronic brake distribution, and even vehicle dynamic control. So vehicle dynamic control uh, uses your throttle response, your accelerator, and also it applies brakes so to control the vehicle in emergency situations. Also, uh, the Nissan Terra already features uh, front SRS airbags and also curtain airbags to name a few. So now, let's talk some of the features from outside. So the Nissan Terra is a really good looking vehicle sharing its design cues with other Nissan vehicles. The Nissan Terra can seat 7 people comfortably. All in all, there are 10 cup holders and there are also 4 aircon vents to cool uh, the people at the back. So the middle seats can fold 60-40 and the third row seats can fold 50-50 so it can fold flat to accommodate more cargo room. Even with the mid-model Nissan Terra, it already has the 18-inch wheels that you can also see in the top of the line model. For added convenience, the rear seats can be folded by pushing the button uh, at the front row located near the gear lever. All in all, the Nissan Terra is a really great SUV. It can seat 7 people comfortably and it has a lot of storage space for out of town trips. It handles well in the twisties and it has all the power you need. Hope you like my review and please like and subscribe. Shout out to Paper Job and Tita Christie for uh, letting me borrow this unit for my review. So, thank you all very much. See you soon. Shout out din po pala sa mga taga Binangodan Auto Club. So, salamat po sa mga sumusuporta. So, please subscribe and share the videos. Thank you.